Okay, here we have an 8 lug to a 6 lug adapter. This is a two piece adapter. See, there's, there's two pieces here that are bolted together. It is very limited in application because of the depth of this hole. 7 eighths of an inch. So we've got 7 eighths of an inch is all that you're from the mounting surface of your drum where your studs on your truck are to this piece here that center bore can only stick out seven eighths of an inch or these are not going to work without further alterations or other problems okay i've taken out the bolts you got four bolts that have a conical seat see the tapered seat on the head there and you've got four bolts that are cap style bolts that have a flat seat on them so when you put it together you got to make sure you put the the proper bolts in the proper holes and then we've got that's the back of the top piece it has uh, um, your studs in it and there's the first piece. This piece has to bolt on to your vehicle. And you see you've got a shallow, a shallow hole here. Okay, so when you put this on, you've got to have small lug nuts that are going to fit down in here. And also going to have to cut the studs of your vehicle off. Your, your truck is going to have a... A stud that's sticking in up through here. It's going to be bigger than this, of course. But it'll be sticking up through here past the surface of this. You have to cut, you have to grind or cut that down so that this is completely flat. Okay, the stud coming out of your vehicle cannot come past this surface right here so that the second piece will go flat down on there. It can't be, can't be anything sticking up there. Okay. Then once the, uh, once this piece is on and torqued down to your truck, then you take the first piece here, you put it on, you torque it down to your truck. You take the second piece and put it on there and take the, bolts and put them all in I recommend that these bolts there's all eight of them that you use Loctite on these bolts but as I said it's very important to make sure that this is making a good surface between the two pieces and then put all these bolts in and torque them down with Loctite on them then you mount your wheel on here and torque it down It's not an, e not an easy job. It is labor intensive cutting those studs off and everything to make it all fit together. But that's what you got. So there it is. This is Richard with MyWheelAdapters.com. If I can help you with anything, feel free to visit my website or give me a call. All of that I have available is not on the website. So if you don't see what you need, then give me a call or email. MyWheelAdapters at gmail.com. Good day.